Moving on um, now to a trial that we have covered. It's a trial in San Francisco that's getting a lot of national attention. Nima Momeni is accused of stabbing Cash App founder Bob Lee to death last year. The two men were actually seen together on security footage not long before the attack. Elise Preston is following this case. Jurors in San Francisco heard the first arguments Monday in the high-profile trial over the murder of tech mogul Bob Lee. There's no question as to who killed Bob Lee or really how he was killed. The question is whether or not it was murder or self-defense. Defendant Nima Momeni pleaded not guilty to first-degree murder last year. Prosecutors say he stabbed Lee with a kitchen knife in the early morning hours of April 4th, 2023, and left him to die. The murder put the city on edge for more than a week. I acknowledge and understand how the loss of a young, vibrant leader and innovator has rocked our city and even beyond. The pair was captured by a security camera, leaving Momeni's younger sister, Kazar's apartment building, before Momeni allegedly stabbed Lee three times. In court, prosecutors presented Lee's chilling 911 call, in which he cried for help 47 times before going silent. Prosecutors allege the killing was connected to Lee's relationship with Kazar Momeni. They say a witness heard Nima Momeni questioning Lee in the hours before the murder about his sister's alleged drug use, citing a text she later sent to Lee that read, I know Nima came way down hard on you. So the prosecution is going to use Momeni's role as a brother to say, he thought something strange was happening to his sister. He thought something bad was happening, and that's why he killed Bob Lee. The toxicology report revealed Lee had cocaine, ketamine, and alcohol in his system at the time of his death. How does that come into play when you're presenting this case to a jury? I think the defense will absolutely use the drugs and try and tell the story of somebody, Bob Lee, who was out of control, and here's Momeni just trying to defend himself. Kazar Momeni is expected to take the stand this week. It's unclear if the defendant, her brother, will also testify. For CBS Mornings, I'm Elise Preston.